Okay, I'm back. Mm. Stupid spit. That was not even half of my breath right there. I could have gone on for twice as long. But then a stupid spit threatens to go down into your lungs while you're while you got your trachea open. You know? It's like stupid spit. It's a wonder it's not doing that in my sleep. Then again, maybe it is. I don't know. Jeez. There's no way to tell. Anyway, guys, welcome back to Let's Play Metroid Prime 2. We have just made it back to Sanctuary after making a detour off to Torvus to get power bombs. A lot of backtracking involved, but then again... I never really stated my whole case for backtracking, mainly because I kind of don't have as much faith in it these days as I used to. My biggest case for backtracking, really, is just that that's what real life is. It's like, people don't seem to mind the fact that in real life, you know, you come to the same house every day, you go drive on the same roads to the same places, the same grocery store, the same bank, the same movie theater, the same work, same shit, different day, all the time. Yet in video games, and in, like, I guess that's the only reason I like it in video games, is because it allows you to kind of get to know the world better. And I don't feel like I know the world as well if I'm only seeing every piece of it just one time. Of course, then again, that's why you play a game twice, is to get to know them. Wait, shit, shit, wrong gun. So finally, we get to fight these guys. Which I don't even know, yeah, I do have to scan again, because now they're alive, which they weren't before. These are the Ink Smashers, Rogue Assault Drone, we don't care. All I know is we want to kill it, so... Damn it, why did I do that? Why didn't I charge that up? Smash! And can I get you? Yeah, nice. But you can't freeze them like you can some of the other ones. So you just have to count on... Regular old super missiles or what have you. I think it only takes one light shot to disable that shield thing they put up, though. And then you just, like, finish them off with a super missile. Or numerous super missiles, as it were. I don't think he's got that much left in him. He can't have that much more. He must be getting weak now. He must be getting tired and weak. You're getting weak? I'm gonna hide under here, man. I'm gonna just sleep under here, man. You're not dead yet? Okay, fine. Screw this. I picked up that missile expansion for a reason. And obviously you were it, so... Fudge! Okay, anyway. <laughs> Sorry, here. Just just die. Just die. Please. Can you do that? You're dead. Okay, good. What is moving up there? But guess what? No, not a second one! Yeah, that's right. We can fight a second one. I just, I don't know why I always quote that. I think that line is hilarious, because in the Water Hands, we did that once. Or I did that, actually, in one of my movies. It was, a uh, basically, Water was demonstrating to Aqua this super kick move he had. Where, like, and I got it from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2, actually. It's in that scene where Kino's trying to get into the Foot Clan, and he's fighting that one guy, and the one guy grabs his foot in midair, and he just kind of shakes his glove at him like, uh-uh, and then he turns around and kicks him with the other foot. Um, well, uh, well, in this Water Hands movie, I had Water doing that exact same thing to Aqua, but he was explaining it as he went along. So Aqua had him by the one foot, like his one foot was up and in Aqua's hand, and Aqua was asking these questions, like, you know, Water was explaining that now I'm going to kick you with the other foot. And then Aqua asks him a question. He asks, okay, so what would you do if I grabbed the second one? And it's like, normally, you know, the second one. Normally you would say, like, what would you do if I grabbed the other foot, not the second one. But, but it's funny that he says the second one. I don't know why I think that's so funny. Holy crap, I almost died, man. I, was, I wasn't concentrating on those fights at all because I was talking. Jeez, there's five more minutes of the video. Don't come on me, please. Sorry about that. I don't even be saying that. But we could definitely use this save point here. Yeah, I don't know why. It's just... Why do I think that that's funny? Why do I think it's funny? He says, what if I grab the second? Because when you say the second one, it implies that there's more than two. If there's only two of something, then, well, you just say the other one. Because it's easier. But he says, like, what if I grab the second one? <laughs> Ugh. Let's see, it's, so it made, and when Proton John said it, it could have made sense, because there was probably more than, he was saying it about an eel, or something, and there were probably more than two eels, so it made sense for him to say, no, not a second one. But the reason it makes me laugh is because it reminds me of when Aqua said it in the movie. So now that makes sense, and now you know why I quote that, I mean, that's like forever gonna be 
one of my favorite sayings for now. At least it is right now, it's one of my favorite. There's another one of those beams of light that we can't do anything about, but we do have a map station here, so let's get it. Mm. Not that we really need it, I mean, I think I know this game fairly well. The practice run proved out to be actually extremely useful. Still, there are parts of this area that I'm really not sure about. I don't even want to look at that. No, sir. See, that's why I say the map is not that useful, because did you see that just now? That looks like, um... <laughs> that looked like an unfinished game of Pyramid, basically, is what that looked like. It looked like that guy's teeth in the life of David Gale. That one redneck's teeth. Oh, shit. I meant to have it on dark there, but... Oh, man, I nice trying to put up a shield there. That was very good. Very smart. Very coactive. What's very confident. Very bold and confident. Whoosh. Yes. Fuck you, Resbit. Gonna have me for breakfast? I don't think so. But how about a monster for breakfast today? Good old Count Chocula. I'd much rather have Booberry. If I, I swear, if there, if if I could find somewhere around here that sells Booberry cereal, that's all I would eat for the rest of my life. Because for all I know, that could be two years. I hope it's not, because I want to go to two more than two more magfests. And judging by the working out, I haven't been, like, going to the gym as much because I've been working out more at home. I have my weights here, because nowadays, it's like, I pretty much lost most of the weight that I wanted to lose. It's pretty much 100 pounds. I've gone down from 275 to 175. So now I'm kind of working more on... Do I really want to go that way? Because from what I remember, that doesn't really go anywhere. Yeah, it goes to that room, and I don't like that room because I can't do anything there. Or can I? Wait. But this just goes over here to that secret key. Think. Maybe we do want to go that way. Do I have way? I do have power ones. Okay, I am gonna go that way. I just remember last time I went that way, I couldn't do much, and maybe it's just because I didn't know what to do. But okay, whatever. Obviously, you're coming back here with power bombs. There's a power bomb door, so what else are you gonna freaking do? You know? Are these also Illuminati turrets? I have to assume. So. This was their city, after all, their stronghold. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> you better have lots of power bombs in store because you're gonna need them for this. There's got to be a better way to get this, though. See, there's an expansion right up here. And I've seen people, like, what they do is basically bomb jump and then, and then, like, come out of the bomb, come out of their morph ball form and jump. The same way that, kind of like you do in the original Metroid. Oh, shit, I don't have any power bombs. Okay, we're not doing this now, then. We'll come back here later. There will be more times to do it. This is not the first time we're going through this room. Definitely not the last. I thought there was another turret in there. There's something over here, isn't there? Anything? No? Okay. But anyway, it's this room. I hate this room. I really hate this room, man. Because it just drives me crazy. First of all, there's two of those spider things down here. And... Yeah! Yeah, you can't do this room now because I don't have the... thing. The echo visor. The thing that I spoiled. Okay, can I get at least one of you guys? Oh, I did, didn't I? I got one. Are you gonna, like, buckle up and do your thing? Yeah, there we go. I'm gonna hit you again, just for good measure. Then I got you in the balls. It is so easy to whittle your health down in this little stretch of the game. The save points become a little more sporadic. And, well... If you gotta go down, go right towards the screen, otherwise the camera's gonna try to get behind you and then you can't see what you're doing. So if you want the camera behind you... Oh, wait, wait, that was my chance! Oh, did I get him? I did, I did, I did. Here's your balls. Here we go. <laughs> oh my god, it's like that guy in that video that I, that they linked to on Cracked. He's like, Will you fart on my balls when you f? Oh, it's... Oh my god. Will you quack like a duck when you suck? Will you fart on my balls? No, anyway, just never mind. Torvis balls? What happened to Aegon? I must have missed that one. Oh. The Ing turned their focus to the Torvis Borg next, sending a vast force to lay siege to the temple there. Thousands upon thousands of Ing were destroyed by our warriors, yet they kept coming until there was no Luminoth alive to offer resistance. On that day, the energy of Torvis was taken to Dark Aether, and our hopes for survival grew dim. Very much so. Thank God. Okay, let's do this. 
Once again, I don't think I'm supposed to be in here. I swear to God, I'm not supposed to be in here. Because I'm supposed to get the thing first. Oh, I already said it. I already said that. Let's talk about something else. Oh yeah, these are good. These guys are good for getting more power bombs back because they, well, they drop them for one thing. And since there's eight of them, the likelihood of getting a drop is fairly decent. I'm not even sure, like, if you have to actually shoot them to kill them, because it seems like most of them just kind of die off by themselves after they bounce around a little bit. What was in that room? Huh. Interesting little insignia on the walls. I love this. Oh god, I love this window. <sighs> Whoa, what, 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 what? Holy crap, can I scan? Oh, I can. How about that? The unit functions well, despite several DECA cycles of service. Uh, <laughs> The working class hero drone, basically. What can I say to that, man? I tell ya. Okay, where does this elevator go? Oh, this one goes back to Torvis. Yes! I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it. You guys, I've got this. If only I'd known about that sooner. Can I even get to where that goes in Torvis, though? I'm not sure. I knew I wasn't supposed to be in this freaking place. But this second room, you're supposed to be able to get to the Dark World, but you can't do that until you have... until you deactivate the things. There is a missile expansion we can get here. I don't feel like messing with it right now. Well, actually, maybe I do. It's not that hard to get. It's just up here. But, uh... Oh, that is if you don't get shot. It's by something. Dude, stop doing that. Oh, why are you guys respawned? You guys suck, you know? Oh, well, I guess they can shoot you. Would you get your leg out of the way so I can get on the freaking spiderball track? Jeez. Thank you. Let's see if we can do this without all the commotion. This one isn't that hard to get. As long as you just work. Okay, good, you missed. You definitely do, I missed indeed, and I just balls that up like you would not believe, man. Oh, go, 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 go. No, you're not gonna go, are you? Now they're gonna sit there right on top of that. There. I'm just gonna boost through you guys, I'll tell you. Oh, that was pretty bad. Oh, great, now he's gonna be able to shoot me anywhere. Okay, you know what? We'll get that one later. Jeez Louise. If I had the screw attack, I could practically just jump to it from somewhere. Well, actually, no, I couldn't, because I can't get to that door. There's like two doors over there, the bottom one and then the top one. And the bottom one is the one I went through. Ha 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 ha! You weren't there a second ago, were you? You are now. Jeez, out of four energy tanks. Definitely gonna have to hit up that save point again when we get back. Gonna go ahead and try to grab this one if we can. The thing is, I'm not even sure I want to go for this one because I have to fight another one of those Ink Smashers. Only this time, it's worse. Well, last time I fought two of them, so maybe not. Maybe it won't be so bad. There's not really a lot in the way of damage dealing that can be done, but uh, yeah, you want to scan this one too because it's actually a dark Ink Smasher, which is unlike the other one. Which means that actually it's weak to light. Ah. I was gonna say it was weak to light, but then it went and put its light shield up, like it's so very uncharacteristic of a dark, dark thing. Okay, now you're putting up the dark shield. Yeah, nice. Yeah, you gotta hit him at just the right angle, too, with that. Yeah, this isn't that hard to dodge, this little quaking thing that they do. You just pretty much stay in the air as much as you can. Yeah, see, he's dead already. And he dropped a power bomb, so... Worth it! Yes. And there's no second one, but there is a light one. So. This is kind of a... This is an excruciating puzzle. Because you gotta go back and forth and back and forth. Which is why I really wish I knew how to do that bomb jumping... thing where they... I don't know, whatever it is that they do. Plus, it is also possible to actually fall down to where you just were and have to do the entire puzzle all over again, so make sure that you don't do that. Plus, and you gotta sit there and watch this whole big uh, rigmarole about 15 times. Actually, only like 4 times, but it's enough. It's enough to get under your skin a little bit here. So then we're back in the dark world, we take the spider ball tracks, and what do we do? keep the spider ball button down. Now at this point, I don't even know what part of the room I'm in. I just know that I go forward and go to the next one. So, <laughs> you just kind of have to take it on faith that you're going the right way here and hope that the puzzle 
somewhat makes sense. It doesn't make sense to me geologically or geographically, but I don't care because I know that eventually it's going to take me to where I need to go. Just make sure you don't fall right there. Because this is it. Keep pressing up on the joystick here and it'll keep going this right direction. Forward, basically. Oh, no, no, this is a power bomb expansion. Well, shit. I'm glad I got this, then. I thought I was doing this for a missile. I always forget, too. I always think this is a missile expansion. It's not. It's a power bomb expansion. Oh, wait, now it's getting confused now. Doesn't know which way to go. <laughs> okay, we're out of here. So, oops, no, that was the warp, so we need to go this way. Whew. Oh, here you are again. Trying to make my life a living hell. Oh, you dropped some good energy. So, since this is that room, I'm gonna go ahead and... Ah, I'm not even gonna mess with you. I'm gonna head right back to the bottom and hit up that save point. Just to refill my energy. And it's a good idea to do this pretty frequently, if you can. So I went into that door and basically got nothing done, except for getting that power bomb expansion. These last two episodes have been the most unproductive thing you've ever seen. Holy moly. Jeez, thought I would have remembered this better. I knew, I just knew there was a... Ugh, it drives me crazy because I don't know what else I can... Oh, I do know what else I can do. Jeez, and I was just thinking about that too. You know what, next time on Metroid Prime, guys, we will do what we're supposed to do. Because I know what we're supposed to do now. See you guys later.